believe the, the, the case and the situation surrounding Julia Davis uh, is a situation of historical significance in retaliating against somebody doing what they should do as an American, which is pointing out a flaw, a dangerous flaw. So I think it'll set a precedence that they'll be talking about it, perhaps in law schools and, and political science classes, maybe a hundred years from now. I could have never imagined anything so outlandish as what would happen to us in real life. I'm Brittany Murphy's father, Angelo. Brittany also was called as a witness in the Julia Davis case. Brittany did tell me she was under surveillance, and uh, incidentally, so was I. Simon Monjack and Brittany Murphy were subjected to the same terror tactics that were utilized by the Department of Homeland Security in the Julia Davis case. We were told to be especially vigilant during national holidays. A special designated date to watch was July 4th, 2004, Independence Day, when intelligence data suggested the highest possibility of terrorists attempting to enter the United States. It's not an issue of any wrongdoing. It's the, the government is more concerned about the person making the report than fixing the problem. Our neighbor, Matthew Judd, filmed a Black Hawk helicopter raid of our home. He uh, was shaking. I mean, if he wasn't holding the camera steady. Only weeks after turning over the tape to us, Matthew Judd was found dead in his home. He was only 25 years old. Did I, uh, did I view her as a threat to national security? Yes, but if you knew a February 40, threat to security, somebody is February 40. On that video, sir, Julia Davis, is domestic terrorist.